kid. You're in big trouble now. All right! All the money in the jail! Come on! Move it! about the rent, the check's in the mail, I swear to God. Is that your truck? Yeah, where'd you find it? Great. You're under arrest. Because this was an armed robbery and the defendant has appeared before me previously. Your Honor, I was framed. Quiet. I'm going to set bail at $10,000. Great, you take visa? Court is in recess. Was I strict enough? Oh, yes. Very. I want to show you something. I've computed our take from the sale of the cars. It comes to over $50,000. Nadra, <laughs> you've changed my whole life. You've taught me a whole new way of looking at the law. Well, let's go over to your place. I'll show you a whole new way of looking at my body. Oh, yes, the clinic. I have an appointment with Doc Williams. Ah, Joan, right on time. I love punctuality. Why don't you come this way? I am a little harried right now. I'll tell you, why don't you wait in my office? I think you'll be a bit more comfortable in here. Okay. Then we'll get to that examination in a couple of minutes. I am dying to get at your rear end. Mm -hmm. Mm. She's ready to go, Mr. Kalinowski, and purring like a kitten. I'll see you back here in 6,000 miles, not a mile over. Carl, want to back it up for Mr. K? OK, Joan, I'm ready for you now. All right, Doc. Let's go take a look at it, shall we? Mm -hmm. Follow me, please. Doc, shouldn't I be wearing a gown? Oh, don't be silly. We're not that formal around here. What the? All right, Joan, uh, excuse me. Hello, the clinic. Yes, Mr. Armistead. Yes, sir, could you hold a second, please? Uh, Joan, why don't you get it up on that rack and give me a holler as soon as you're ready. Uh, yes, Mr. Armistead. Uh, I see. Well, that's the same problem we had in the past, isn't mm -hmm. it, sir? Is there a constant vibration? God, there's so many doctors in here. Now? What's this? Gas analysis. I see. All right, Gosh. what I'd like you to do is bring it in as soon as possible and let's recheck it. No, I want you to bring it in immediately, sir. Let's snip this in the bud. That's my uh, that's my motto. Jeff, how does your week look? Thursday's impossible. How about oh. Friday at 2.30 p.m.? All right, Doc, I'm ready. Roger. <laughs> you can. <laughs> Fine, I'll see you on 2.30 uh, on Friday. Go on, Mr. Armistead. Ah, will you two guys please check out that rear end? <laughs> okay, so now what? <gasps> hey, kids. Look at this. <laughs> hey, come on, come on, come on. All right, all right. It's just a fake. Oh, no, it's not. Wink, would you leave my kids alone? Okay, now then. For five points, true or false, you may make a U-turn in between intersections of a business district. False. That's absolutely right. Congratulations. Now... What's going on with you kids? Yeah, nice accessories. Matching, no less. How MTV of you kids. So this is serious, kind of, huh? 
It's just not fair we have to study this hard. I think it was fair I greased up my ass every day and you had Manny Moe and Jack looking up it. You feel better, don't you? Why do I find all this intriguing? Dana, we've been at this for hours. Yeah, we can pass that test. Look, I lost a $20,000 account. I'm facing 10 to 20 years on a major felony. I'm going to head up the river. I want to drive myself up the river, all right? You with me? Yeah. OK, I knew I could talk you into it. Now then, when entering an intersection, Williams, pass. Roth, pass. McCarthy, pass. Hopkins, pass. Papadopoulos, pass. Cannon. Pass. All right. right. We all made it. <laughs> That's the good news. The bad news is these written tests count only 5% of your grades. What? You got to be kidding. You mean we have to take another test before we can get our certificate? That's right, Miss Hopkins. So, if you'll all follow me into the parking lot, we'll have your driving skill tests. Hey, what's the matter, baby? Why so cold? Nothing. Oh, come on, is he kidding? Is this amusing or what? The object of this test is to stay within the white painted lines regardless of the obstacles in your path or the conditions of the road. Let's begin with Mr. Grieber. Go get him, Scotty. All right, Grieber. I'd get used to public transportation. 